Hi everyone, it's Makatama here and welcome back to another video and I'm so so excited for one of these types of videos. It's been a while since I've done a buy manga online with me. I've done a lot of manga shopping in person but it's been a while since I've had a really hearty big fat right stuff haul. So I decided with a huge right stuff birthday anniversary sale that they're having usually around this time of the year it is time to pick up some goodies from Right Stuff. So I'm so, so excited for this video. I've seen a couple of previews of what's in this sale, but I haven't actually taken a look at it myself yet. So if you guys haven't checked out this sale, it'll be a first time for the both of us. And I actually have my iPad right here. So we'll be going along through the Right Stuff website and just picking out all the manga that interests me and also pick out manga to finish parts of my collection. Before we get on with the shopping, I wanted to thank FlexiSpot for sponsoring this video. Before we begin, I wanted to thank FlexiSpot again for sponsoring this video. If you guys have seen my recent hauls in my manga room video, you guys know that I love FlexiSpot's Fiji standing desk. I use this desk from packaging sticker orders to filming all of my unboxing and showcase videos on my channel. And now I'm moving into my college apartment because I want it to be my main desk. So disassembling and also assembling again, both were super quick and easy. So I have the white version here, but there are so many other options of desktop color, size, and also desk frame. So you can customize it perfectly to fit your workspace. I've been using this desk for the past year now, and I've used it every day, guys, and it's never ever failed me. It never shakes, even though I've smacked more than 70 plus volumes on it, 5,000 huge right stuff packages, and the adjustable height really makes it perfect for multi-purpose use. Filming, hauls, just reading, writing, everything. So please check out my description below to get your own desk. It's so sleek, sturdy, and long-lasting. This is my forever favorite work desk. So if you guys want to see how I used my Vici desk and how I set everything up, please check out my manga room makeover and tour video. Thanks again to FlexiSpot. So now let's get on to the next portion of this video. All right, guys, so it's time to start. We're on the Right Stuff homepage right here. And I'm just so, so excited for this birthday sale. If you guys have watched my videos in the past year, you guys would know that I haven't had that many hauls. And it's because I've been holding off on buying more manga until I've read more. But these past couple of months, I've been working really hard to read more and to not buy any manga for the time being. So I would honestly say it's been a really long time since I've had a huge haul like this. So here's my search query. I'm hiding all of the adult ones. I'm gonna view everything that's on sale now and also only stick with manga for now. I'm just going to sort it by relevance and there's 683 products. So let's go ahead and get started. So looking at these, I'm not too interested in any ones in this row here, but if you guys have any recommendations for what is a really great deal on Right Stuff at this moment, please leave it down in the comments below for other people to reference and even for me too if I wanna buy a second round. So every week they release some new series to this sale. So it's really exciting to come back and check in weekly. So as I go through this sale, I don't have anything planned at all. So this will just be free form and just all my thoughts going through just browsing. <laughs> So the first one I see is Message to Adolf. I've heard a lot about this and I know people do collect this, but I'm not too sure what it's about. I've never researched into it. And so for all the ones that I'm even remotely interested in, I'm just gonna add it to cart and then we can eliminate later. And so this one's out of stock, but that's okay with me. I think just getting the good deal is worth the waiting time. And don't toy with me, Miss Nagatoro. I'm really interested in getting this. And so, but this is the seven to nine bundle and I don't wanna be getting that if I don't already have volumes of this and especially if I haven't read it yet. For series that I don't know if I want to collect yet, I'm only going to collect the first three. So I'm seeing when will Ayumu make his move? I've also heard about this. It looks really cute. The price is so good right now. So I'm keeping my eye on this one as well. And then there's Vampire Dormitory. I don't know too much about this one. And then there's Shaman King. I've heard great things about this, but I don't think that's a priority for me right now to collect. And Lovesick Ellie, I've also seen this one. It looks so adorable. I'm gonna open this in a new tab. All right, so Lovesick Ellie, these covers look so, so adorable. I'm a huge sucker for shoujo series that have really cute covers. So let's take a look at the description and see if this is something that I'd be interested in picking up. 
very interesting premise. I've seen things like this <laughs> in the past with other shoujo series, but it looks really cute. I'm considering it, so let me just add it to cart. Now let's go back and continue on. We have Life Lessons with Uramichi, this thing. <laughs> and then we have Beauty and the Beast of Paradise Lost. I've heard of these two. Primitive Boyfriend, I've also heard of that. I believe it's an older series. Um, nothing stands out too much for me in this page. And then we have How to Treat Magical Beasts. Very interesting that there's a manga. And How to Kind of Receive. I've also heard things about this series. Inside Mari, I've heard it's pretty interesting, but it's also really deep, this one. And then there's Heavenly Delusion. I think I'm gonna pass on the ones here. We have an isekai one. Wow, this one's really interesting. Higehiro, after being rejected, I shaved and took in a high school runaway. I'm confused. This sounds like a light novel to me, <laughs> like the title. All right, and then this one, I shall survive using potions. My dad's the queen of all VTubers. This sounds really interesting. So that's page one, and let's go on to page two. We have Golden Japanesque, a splendid Yokohama romance manga. This week, there's also some yen press specials so that's really amazing all right i am intrigued by this one it looks very very pretty living in meiji era maria must hide her blonde hair this just looks really funny to me he can't help but say something you're like a mermaid very interesting it's a historical romance i think it looks pretty fascinating let me just add it for now all right going back carol and tuesday i have yet to watch the show for this but really excited to and then we have some pokemon Master Keaton. I've also heard very great things about this manga as well. I'll pass on that for now. Fist of the North Star. Heard the good things about that. 20th Century Boys. I've been wanting to collect this series for the longest time, but I'll see if they have the or one to three bundle first. The Rising of the Shield Hero. Heard good things about that as well. Tomorrow Make Me Yours. This looks really, really cute. And I normally like to get at least two to three volumes of a new series, or it's very hard for me to continue collecting something. Wow, Otakori right now is so extremely cheap. I don't know if I want to collect volume six yet. I already have one to two actually, so I'll see if three to five is available and then I'll get volume six. So I'll add this to cart just in case I lose it later but there's that. You can also buy individual ones, but I tend to like the bundles a bit better. All right, we have weathering with you. I have, oh, this sucks really bad because I have volume one, but I do not want to have a duplicate. <laughs> All right, so here, star-crossed, this looks really cute. And then we have blue period. I've honestly really been loving blue period. I've watched the anime and I don't have any of this series in manga form yet. It's not a priority for me, but the price is also really good. So I will keep this in my cart and keep thinking about that one. And so we have a couple of the other series that we saw previously. Um, let's see if there's anything new that we haven't seen. This one on to page four. Beyond the Clouds, I've also heard really good things about this series. Art looks absolutely stunning. And then there is Sweat and Soap. I've heard it's a really fascinating series. I kind of want to check it out by the same time. Also not a priority for me, so I'll be looking to see if they have possibly the one, two, three volume bundles. Skip and Loafer, I've heard really good things about this one as well. It looks so adorable. So this is volume two, and I kind of want to check out volume one first. This is a school life romance series. I could tell by the cover. <laughs> I really like the art style. It's giving a little bit of the 90s, 80s style, but I will need to see if volume one and volume three are available, but to not lose that one, I'll add it to cart. In this haul, I don't want to be buying too many new series just because I'm really aware that I have a lot of unfinished series. So I'll be keeping an eye out on those for sure and trying not to start too many new ones. But for such a good sale, like the right stuff, anniversary sale, it's so hard <laughs> to skip on series that looks good. Beauty and the Feast, really interesting. <laughs> a lot of repeating series. And then we have Go With the Clouds North by Northwest. I've really wanted to collect this for a really long time 
when I don't have it yet, but I'm definitely not going to collect up to volume five for now. I'll probably just stick with the first three if I can find it somewhere here. Gentle Noble's Vacation Recommendation. That sounds really cute. Weathering with you, nice. So you can buy these separately. So for now, I'm just going to add this one to cart and hopefully I can find volume two somewhere here. I also really want Made in Abyss. My eyes will be peeled. <laughs> we have this bundle. Don't Toy With Me, Miss Nagatoro, volumes one through three. And wow, there is the Eternal Sailor Moon editions. This was one of my ultimate collecting goals was to collect all of Sailor Moon Eternal Edition. And this is so enticing. But at the same time, it's become less of a priority in the last year. I still really want it, but I think I want to collect some new series more than this one, but hopefully next year it comes back. And so I do really want to try out Doing Tour With Me, so I think I'm going to add this and see how it is. All right, these next ones look okay. The Cat Proposed, that looks really interesting. A Sign of Affection, that is absolutely lovely. And it is so, so cheap right now. $7, you guys. You guys need to get this. <laughs> All of my volumes, I believe, because I bought my Assign of Fashion volumes mostly from Amazon and also Kinokuniya. So mine were 12 plus dollars. So if you guys can get your hands on this one during the Right Stuff sale, you guys are saving so much. So onward to page nine. Which hat? I'm so, so excited for this. I believe I'm up to volume five on this right now. So because I love the series, I'm going to add this to my cart. And this is one that I want to continue collecting. Baby Bear's Bakery. This looks so cute. Let's take a look at this one. That's adorable. <laughs> so Baby Bear is the best baker you may have never heard of. He's also a baby, guys, so his business sense is a little lacking. This is so cute. It looks so adorable. I really wish they had a bit more photos to show what the art looks like and you know how thick this volume is. Because from here, I can't tell what type of series this is. I know I can search it up online, but it would also be pretty convenient to just be able to scroll through pictures of like the size and stuff like that. All right, so now I'm also seeing Villain Saga, amazing series at an amazing price right now, especially for like the huge thick hardcovers that you get. Definitely pick this one up if you guys want to check out that. Villain Saga bundle, that's amazing. Here it is. Here's what I've been searching for. The 20th Century Boys perfect edition volumes one through four bundle. So I'm thinking about it right now. Um, I'm going to add it to my cart for now and then we can review it later. But I've really been wanting to collect that series for a while. All right, I'm scrolling a little bit fast because we've seen a lot of these series before. Koi volume four and Witch Hat Atelier volume six. So I don't believe I have volume six yet. So I'm adding this and volume four. I definitely want. So I'm going to add this. Weathering With You volume two. I want this one. So thankful for these individual volumes. There's Devil's Line, which I've really heard good things about. I've seen the anime. Volume four, I definitely want this one. So, wow, 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 wow. This is really amazing, this one right here. There, it's a Makoto Shinkai bundle, and this is really amazing. So all of these series are incredibly popular. I believe the most popular one is five centimeters per second, and that's the one I have, but I don't have the other three, but I really do want these. So She and Her Cat, adorable series I've heard. Voices of a Distant Star is also really well known. And the next one that I want out of these four is Garnet of Words. But if they do sell all three of these separately, I will definitely be thinking about picking these up. And this is such a great price for all four of them. Wow, they also have the girl from the other side. I've heard really, really good things about this series. From other manga YouTubers and just from people on Instagram, I've heard good things. I, yes. So right now I have volumes one and two for the Japanese version, but I see myself wanting to collect the entire English version, like being up to date with this series in English rather than Japanese. So I think I'm gonna go for both volumes one and two. Hopefully I see a bundle for these, but I haven't yet. So I'll just add these two for now. And I've already read this, these ones, but I just really want to try collecting it in English. The Princess and the Frog manga, that's kind of funny. Voice of a Distant Star. So I've 
Heard good things about this. This is by Makoto Shinkai. We reviewed that. We saw this in the bundle. It's currently out of stock. This is not my first priority for Makoto Shinkai's series, but I will add the cart for now and we can eliminate later. <laughs> wow, and there's also Mobile Suit Gundam. Quality of this hardcover is absolutely amazing. If you watch unboxings and reviews online for that, it's insane how good the quality is for these. So highly recommend. She and her cat, I also really want this one by Makoto Shinkai, so I'm gonna add to cart. Happy Cafe, I have read this a long time ago. This is an older series, it's really cute. Future Diary, oh, this sucks that it's no longer available, but Future Diary, I watched the anime and it was really, really good. This Full House volume is only $1, that's absolutely insane, but I think this is a spare volume. I don't think they have the entire series. Garden of Words, this is the one that I've been wanting, so I'm definitely getting this one. Ayako, I've heard interesting things about. <laughs> I remember this series very distinctly from people's reviews and things like that because of the cover. It looks really interesting, but I, I'll pass on that for now. Five centimeters per second. This is such a good steal. I feel like I bought this for around $15. Around $12 is a great price. If this had been 10 years ago, I would be so obsessed with these types of series. But for now, I'm not going to get them because a lot of them are spare volumes and right stuff doesn't have the entire series because they're out of print so it's a bit harder to find and that's why i'm not going to be getting any of these series but still very much worth the read kari kono what a lovely series i would get this but it's so hard to find this entire series recently and i kind of want to see if i can buy the whole set from somebody in the future because i currently have volume six that's the only volume I have, and I don't want to be stuck with a bunch of random volumes scattered throughout the series, and I'd rather buy the bundle, so I'll be looking for a used set. So yeah, we've reached the end of all of the volumes on sale this week. All right, guys, I think it's time to review our cart. So right now I have 22 items for a subtotal of $380, and so we need to cut that down. <laughs> Let's take a look. So the first one I have, Garden of Words. I really do want this one, so I'm keeping this. She and Her Cat, I also really want this one, so I'm keeping this one. Voices of a Distant Star, I don't want this as much as the other two above Makoto Shinkai series, so I think I'm gonna save this for later. And Onward, we have Wotakoi. I really want this series one of my top priorities for a really long time now. So I'm keeping volume two, keeping volume one. So Witch Hat Atelier, I need volume four. So I'm keeping this one. And then we have Weathering With You, volume two. I need this because <laughs> I have volume one, but that's it. But I really want to finish this. So we have volume two and hopefully volume three is in here somewhere. And we have Wotakoi, volume four. And then Witch Hat volume six. Uh, it sucks that I didn't do these in order, so it's a bit confusing. And then I have 20th Century Boys, the bundle. I'm still debating on this. I've wanted this for a long time, but I don't know if I want to start this. I don't know if I would rather start this series or, you know, try and see if there are other series that I need to get. So which I tell you, volume seven, also really want this one. So I'm getting it. Don't toy with me, this one. I might have to pass on this one. I would say this one versus 20th Century. I would prefer 20th Century Boys over this series. So for now, I'm gonna save for later. All right, so here it is, Weathering With You Volume 3. Perfect. Finishing Weathering With You in this haul, beautiful. Now we have Skip the Loafer Volume 2, but I didn't see Volume 1. But now thinking about it, looking at my entire cart altogether, I don't know if I want to start the series right now, so for this one, I'm also gonna save for later. So the next one is Blue Period Volumes 1 through 4, and I really do want this one. I'm keeping this in my car for now, but I think this would be one of the first ones I eliminate, just because this is starting a new series. All right, I have Otokoi Volume 6, perfect. So after Otokoi, we have Golden Japanesque, A Splendid Yokohama Romance. And I really do want this series, I think collecting like shoujos is a guilty pleasure of mine, honestly. So I do want to keep this one. And then we also have Lovesick Ellie. Okay, so I have two new series here and I'm not sure which one I should keep. I'll get back to those. But for this one, when will Ayumu make his move? 
why are there two in here? I don't understand, but I, at the same time, I don't really, or I don't really want to start the series anymore. Time honestly really makes a difference. So I'm gonna just remove this. All right, and we're back and message to Adolf. Heard good things about it. I don't know much about it at all. So I think I'm actually just gonna skip on this for now, just cause I don't really have a huge desire to collect this right now. So that's all in my car. I reviewed everything and let's take a look. So I have 15 things, I eliminated seven and my total is $225. All right guys, so my camera died. So I'm on my phone right now, but actually I'm looking at um, my car. The only volume that's out of stock is Weathering With You Volume 3. And I don't want my package to be delayed because of this one, because right stuff shipping policy is that they will ship all of your items together. So they will wait for the out of stock items to become in stock. So I think I'm just going to save this one for later or I'll check back later. And if there are new series added and if this one is still on sale, then I'll add this when it's back in stock. So I just placed my order and the total came out to be $216 and a half and I've been saving up quite some time by not buying that much manga or other things in general. So I'm pretty pleased with this purchase and the only thing I would say to myself is to be vigilant in continuing collecting the series that I just got, especially the newer series, like the, those two um, shoujo romance ones, I'm definitely going to be keeping up with them or, you know, finding ways to get rid of them if I end up not liking it. And so just to be, you know, just to be more mindful of the series that I'm getting and especially more mindful with what my next steps with those series are. All right guys, so I just finished placing my order. But yeah, thank you guys so much for coming along with me. I've had such a blast going through these series with you guys and I'm really excited to see what next week's sales are and if those are good, watch out for that video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day.